<laughs> hot, 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 hot licks coming at you. <laughs> session here James was he's in one of the bands we're playing with tonight and he was nice enough to let us come through his place and and uh, you know spend a little time right finishing fin re refining and finessing some of these ideas of ours <laughs>
Savannah's been on tour for two weeks in Australia. And now, and along the way we've been writing and rehearsing stuff, trying stuff live. And now we are in Perth at Underground Studios. Very fortunate to work with a drum wizard of a player and an engineer and a producer named Brody Simpson and his partner Mark. So we have two days here, we're gonna try and record an album. I'm interrupting this blog from the future because a couple things need explaining. Like, why are we in Australia? Okay, we didn't just randomly decide to tour Australia. I was supposed to be doing a drum clinic tour in Australia. And then I got asked to do Generation X in the second tour when we did Asia. And so I had to postpone the Australia drum clinic tour six months. And around that time is when the first Childish Shapes album was gonna come out. And so the band had sort of become a thing in the interim. And I was thinking and sort of starting to dream like, man, it'd be so much fun if the band could come with me on the route that I'm already doing for clinics, play shows at all the same, in all the same cities, play with me at the clinics. And also, since Dave lives in LA and we live in New York, we'll all be together, we could work on writing and creating the second album. So that's why we're in Australia. The music, the, the first things you saw of us rehearsing was the first time we've played together, but we had been writing via Dropbox long distance for the, la the, the month or two leading up to that um, because I had been in China for about five weeks, Asher was in Istanbul, Turkey for a couple weeks, Jed was in New York and Dave lives in LA so none of us were near each other so we were doing this sort of new writing uh, sort of method where we just put ideas in Dropbox, we take them out, we add our parts, we put them back and so forth. So when we got together we could start really shaping those ideas, but we were also, as you heard, playing songs from the first album, um, and Dave was singing the parts that Joanna and Courtney usually sing, and uh, that uh, was just because we needed to play shows right when we got there, and we hadn't written and finalized enough material to play a full show. So we had a mix, our, our shows were a mix of, of first album stuff, new material we were writing, in the process of writing, and improv, so we would do some improvisation at each of the shows too, which you heard a little bit in, in Brisbane. So that's that. Everything you just saw in the blog was from Australia. Everything you're about to see in the blog is from Christchurch, New Zealand, which requires a moment of explanation too. Um, 
up until now, we actually just recorded and wrote the, the band part. So we were working on lyrics and melodies throughout that process, but when we were in Perth at the studio, we just recorded drums, bass, and guitar. And then the, the next sort of phase two of the trip was to, to, we had an Airbnb for eight days in Christchurch, and we were gonna work on finishing writing all the lyrics and melodies, and then recording Dave. So we recorded in two places. One at the Airbnb was sort of a homemade uh, ghetto set up with stuff we brought. And then also I had done a drum camp at Orange Studios in Christchurch. So they kind of gave us the keys at night and they were like, lock up when you're done, which was very cool and not New york -y of them. Um, so we did, you'll see some footage of doing uh, vocals as well as some guitar overdubs there at Orange Studios. I think that's all you need to know. Enjoy the rest of the vlog. Stupid, stupid, stupid man. That's how it is. 